In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make uh, some ocean waves uh, synthesised with Soundforge Pro. Um, what we'll do to start with is go to File, New File, um, 44, 100, 16 bit stereo, just the, the default parameters for your file. Click OK. Um, first thing we want to do is go to Simple Synthesis, which I've got a button here. But, um, if not, go to Insert, Synthesis, Simple Synthesis. Now you want to select Pink Noise, uh, which is the uh, white noise which has had certain frequencies filtered out at certain levels. Um, and make sure this is around minus 6 dB um, length where we got 2 minutes 120 seconds so ok so we've got 2 minutes of this that's a uniform pink noise what I want to do is make waves go up and down in time. Um, what we do to get that effect is go to effects, amplitude modulation, uh, we'll go to default all parameters uh, and we'll go to sine. Uh, you'll hear this if you click preview. And you can hear how the the uh, amplitude of that pink noise goes up and down in time. Um, obviously that's too fast for a, an ocean wave so we want to uh, change that from one second to a fraction of a second, say 0. Uh, 0. 0. 0. 0.1, 0. 0.15 so you get like 20 a minute or something like that. Um. Okay, you can hear the, the amplitude goes up and down. Now, this takes it really quiet, so we want to highlight these four and lift it up because it doesn't actually go that quiet at the ocean, and also turn the dry out up to about minus 30 dB. Okay, that's more like it. Well, while, we're, while we're there, I'm going to turn the stereo pan up Ooh, to about 20, so the wave kind of moves across the stereo field. Click OK. There you go, we've got some nice waves there. Uh, but you'll notice they're all all uniform uh, amplitude, which doesn't really happen in the real world, so uh, we'll set, run a second lot of amplitude modulation on it. Uh, and modulate the modulation. Um, this time we'll slow do an even slower modulation, so 0 0.5, whoops, 0 0.05 times a second which is like I, don't, I can't even work it out in my head it's probably like like three or four times a minute it will get to its loudest and then to its quietest um, this time however we turn the dry out up to zero uh, we can turn the wet out up to say 5.4 uh, blend rough edges. Let's preview that. That sounds alright. So you'll see some of them are loud and some of them are quiet, and it'll give you a much more um, irregular feel to your waves. Yeah.
if we undo that, uh, if we go to do modulation again, if we change that to 0 0.06, I think because uh, I think what was happening is because it was exactly a multiple of uh, 0.5 was exactly a multiple of 0.3, every three was loud. So if we change to 0.06, um, it should be less, uh, uh, it should be even more irregular. Let's try that. Yeah, there you go. We've got a couple of quiet ones and then all of a sudden we one loud one. Yeah, a quiet one. Okay, uh, well that's that then. Uh, see you next time. Have fun with the waves.